Hello friends, I'm Randy Eager with Strategic Storm Internet Marketing. We build and market your website so that you don't have to. Welcome to our Mobile Marketing, the new frontier for smartphone strategies webinar. We're going to be busy today. This webinar will demonstrate the latest marketing uses for today's smartphones. More specifically, you'll learn about the latest mobile media revolution, smartphone marketing using barcode technology, and the top 10 mobile applications, and a lot more. If you haven't had a chance to get the link to the handout, you can go to www.strategicstorm.com slash handouts slash mobile marketing dot pdf. So let's get started this way. What you'll learn today. Recession reversal. An overview of how not to get caught in old technology. Many of us are now so caught up in shrugging off the latest technologies that come along for one simple reason. It's new. Have you noticed that technology is changing faster and faster? Smartphones are one technology that are definitely here to stay. Mobile marketing. How business is being played out with smartphones. Here, we're going to take a look at one of the latest new technologies for marketing and marketing your properties. Barcode marketing. While barcodes have been around for years, new barcode technologies are now just taking hold for condensing your entire marketing brochure into one simple barcode that you can read by your smartphone. The best real estate mobile marketing apps will be the 10 best mobile apps for you. Here you'll learn what some of the hottest mobile applications are and why you need them. And finally, wireless point of sale. How texting is taking over the advertising return on investment. Think that texting is just for the young? Well, <laughs> think again. We'll be showing you new data out that shows the average age for those texting now are the 40-somethings. Why? Because the text advertising. You'll see how prolific this is and how it can make unbelievably inexpensive impact on your net results, thus returning a huge return on investment. As you'll see in just a moment, mobile phone usage is huge and the smartphone technology is growing faster every day. Let's first of all define what we mean by smartphones. It's obviously a cell phone, but with many other applications such as calendar, contact database, internet browsers, GPS mapping, magazine and book readers, multimedia players, and hundreds of thousands of other applications that can be downloaded into the unit most of the time for free. The most prolific smartphones are in use now with Apple's iPhone, Motorola's Droid, and the Blackberry. Each phone has the use of separate cell phone services such as AT&T for the iPhone, Verizon and others for the Droid, and Sprint or T-Mobile for the Blackberry. News out now is that the iPhone is just now opening up to Verizon as well. Note that over 172 million smartphones were in place in 2009 based upon a study by Gatner. That's over half the population of the United States. There's a marketing marvel that will have you thriving in 2011, all while your competition wonders what happened. It's all about staying ahead of the curve, staying ahead of the new frontier. To understand what I'm talking about and to prepare you for where we're going, let's take a look at those who didn't get it 
until it was too late. What do these industries have in common? The train or locomotive, the newspaper or publishing, and manufacturing. Think about those technologies or industries. They were crushed by the massive shift in their industry and rather than capitalize on it, they were crushed. Ask yourself this question. What massive shifts in technology are coming my way or your way that I've not accounted for or capitalized on? Let's take a look at three examples. Here's how it happened. Newspaper and print mediums have gotten replaced by the Internet and electronic readers. Some say that we've gone green by doing away with paper. In all actuality, we've created more paper with the huge surplus of information to be able to print. Electronic readers like the Kindle are now replacing books in general. To the same extent, smartphones are replacing newspapers as the news source of choice as there's typically no cost or subscription fee. Trains and locomotives, cars and trucks came along. Think about the limitations of the railroad lines and the huge maintenance costs associated with the locomotive. Now compare this with the infrastructure of today's highways and freeways along with the much lower maintenance of cars and trucks. How does this relate to smartphones? Well, ever try to ship something as large as a computer or even a car? It can be purchased and shipped using the smartphone. Now manufacturing, where's it gone? to China. Why? Because of the super low cost of labor. This has resulted in offshoring and developing countries taking more and more of what manufacturing business we used to have. Which brings up an interesting point. What percent of the smartphone business is manufactured now in the United States? Answer? Almost none. Think of the iPhone. Is it made in the good old USA? Nope. It's made in Shenzhen, China, and other Asian locations. And it can happen to you too, if you're depending on old media. If you're currently using the newspaper, Yellow Pages, postcards or space ads for business, you run the risk of being crushed by your competition. Why? Because the media revolution is at hand. Smartphones, iPads, notebooks, and ebooks are the nomenclature of the day. Old media doesn't work as well as it used to. Your customers, young and old are using new media to decide whom they're going to do business with. And right now that choice is not you, if you're still stuck with the old media patterns. The new media revolution. What's the new media revolution? Well, we could talk about a number of tools, but for our purposes today, let's focus on the mobile media revolution. Now the mobile phone market or smartphone is growing exponentially for both communications and marketing. The main opportunities in mobile marketing fall into five different channels. One, the mobile web and search. This is the biggest activity of smartphone users. Nearly every smartphone comes with a browser and internet link to browse just like a notebook or desktop computer. Two, 
social networking on mobile versions of Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, and others are the second most used activity by smartphone users. Many agents are checking into and posting to their social media while on the road with their smartphones. 3. Applications or apps. Consumers can download onto their mobile devices have generated tremendous consumer buzz. You've probably seen people with dozens and dozens of these apps on their smartphones. Popular smartphone apps can show you where you are on a map or where the closest pizza parlor is and what's more can lead you there turn by turn. Weather, news, periodicals, and sports magazines proliferate as readers. Four. Video downloads is a small but fast-growing opportunity. While screens are generally small, the ability to download a complete movie is getting to be very popular. In addition, webinars like these are even more popular for educational purposes. And five, SMS or text messaging, according to the Wireless Association, the CTIA, 91% of the U.S. population owns a mobile device sending 153 billion text messages per month. Consider this. There are four times as many mobile phone users as Internet users. In addition, 33% of phones use high-speed data services, meaning that they're able to utilize Internet browsers, GPS, and downloading devices. The three big smartphones are Apple's iPhone, RIM's BlackBerry, and Motorola's Android. All are full-featured and have huge download databases of applications. And here's a graph showing the future buying patterns for 2011. The mobile media revolution again. More than anything, smartphones are known for their mobile application market. If you can imagine, there's over 3 billion iPhone apps downloaded already. <laughs> Apple iTunes alone has over 200,000 apps that you can download. And not to be outdone, BlackBerry and Android also have virtual application stores where hundreds of thousands of applications can be downloaded. Now why mobile media matters? Mobile advertising has a 10 times higher click-through rate than online advertising. Let me say that again. Mobile advertising has a 10 times higher click-through rate than online advertising. Why? Because it's handier, more accessible, and more trustworthy. Mobile advertising has eight times higher brand awareness. By using a common format, agents and brokers can increase efficiency in ad creation, trafficking, delivery, and reporting. In addition, Ads can be authored in Adobe Flash and JavaScript technologies and delivered to devices that support Flash or converted for HTML. Mobile traffic has a six times higher purchase intent than online traffic. Since the mobile device is already in their hand, it's easier to immediately do a search for product, service, or even MLS listings. This is a paradigm shift. You need to be where your customers are every day, online and on their phone. I like this, the fishing metaphor. How do you catch fish? Well, there are two basic ways. Either you go to where the fish are, or you find a way to make them come to you. It's the same thing with mobile marketing. If your contacts have you in their database with your cell phone, email, and website addresses, it makes it very easy for them to find you. 
However, if this isn't the case, you must have your website SEO, that's search engine optimization, optimized so that when they do their searches, they'll find you. And having a website must work in tandem with a mobile marketing. Now, you might say that your website can be seen by your smartphone, but can it really be seen? In other words, is your website mobile enabled? Many website owners would really love to have a mobile version of their website available. Not only is it just cool and convenient to browse for the latest information while on the go, it is also becoming very popular and soon most websites will have a mobile version. If you can't offer this service, you may lose visitors in the future. Now is a good time to start learning about the technologies involved and the issues you may run into while deploying a mobile website. You want to be a respected and trusted authority and a yellow page ad isn't going to get it done. New features and tools to aid the real estate agent with today's smartphone. It's one thing to have all sorts of games and cool features on your smartphone, but in this section we're going to raise the bar and show you where the marketing use of your smartphone is going. More and more people are using their cell phones to find local businesses. We are one cell phone contract away from smartphones becoming the norm. Now what does that mean? Well each time you purchase a smartphone you have to sign a contract for the cell phone service. Typically this is for a two-year term, give or take. In two years Smartphones will be the norm and will overtake landlines and cell phones. This means that more and more people will be using their smartphones to search for your business right at the moment when they are in your area and ready to buy. This means that there is coming a huge juxtaposition of technologies between the website and the smartphones. As your prospects are driving neighborhoods and see for sale signs, they'll be able to get more information without even getting out of the car. This is why you must have your business listed in Google Places like pay per click and the yellow pages. Google Places is a purchase location that can locate your business online. And you must have a mobile optimized website like a power site. Why? Well, let's take a look at your site. Now, look at the power site. Now look at your site. See any difference? <laughs> well, of course you do. I'm going to show you the power site in just a moment. The mobile optimized site is much easier to navigate and will keep the attention of your viewers much longer. And here's why you need a mobile optimized site like a power site. Non-mobile optimized site? and mobile optimized website. See the difference? Non-mobile and mobile. The mobile optimized website is easier to read and can be navigated by simply scrolling up and down. Now, if you have a mobile enabled website, you can make it much easier for your viewers to scroll to things like subscribe to new listings as opposed to scrolling all over the place to try and find what's on your website. Do you know what this is? It's the future. 
These are called QR codes, or quick response barcodes. While barcodes have been around for years, they haven't been able to do what the new QR codes can do, especially when combined with your smartphone. QR code technology is as important today as the introduction of blog sites were 10 years ago. They give us an immediate way to deliver all sorts of multimedia information with the click of a button. In fact, I'll tell you that QR barcode technology is going to be even more important to you than blog site technology. The QR code is a powerful way to link a physical item or location to the Internet. In the past, you had paper flyers that the agent would put in the home for the potential buyer to take and read. Then we graduated up to sign boxes that could be attached to the for sale sign. What a big deal that was! Now we have the ability to get a full-blown multimedia tour of the house with multiple color photos and information without even getting out of the car. All you need is a smartphone and free QR barcode technology reading software that can be downloaded from the Internet. Here's how it would work for a real estate agent. You're going to start seeing these QR barcodes on more and more for sale signs in your area. This will be the first step in providing the public with unlimited information about the property, at least as much information that you decide to give to them. The QR code can be scanned by most camera phones or smartphones with a barcode scanner app. Okay, let's take a look at what happens now. The smartphone takes a snapshot of the listing QR code and decodes it. The barcode reader then takes the user to the full listing details. The QR code can be scanned by most camera phones or smartphones with a barcode scanner app. Here's how it works. When you select your barcode application, you'll see that it automatically opens up the camera application on your smartphone and then it provides you with a frame around the barcode. All you need to do is take your phone without touching anything else and just line it up with the code and you'll see your screen flash. It just read the barcode, and it automatically pulls up the listing with all the different pictures and any information that you need to enter onto the listing via the barcode. So here you'll have the pricing, the various pictures, and you can just scroll with your thumb. You can go through the information very quickly and see the pictures come up as well as maps and information about your house branding on there. If you really think about this as a marketing piece, the reason that it's such a benefit to have this technology on a smartphone is that you're only a call away. The phone is in their hand already. That's half the battle. Now here's another exciting part. Not only is the phone in their hand, but here's a technology called click to call. And there's a phone number that you can provide that's highlighted very much like a hyperlink and all you do is touch it and it asks you are you sure you want to call and you say yes and boom that's all there is to it and that's just how quickly someone can get hold of you and it really is a great feature to make it as user friendly as possible the QR code allows your customers to find you in many new and exciting ways. It's fun to use and it's extremely informative like no other technology you've used. Link print ads to your web page, online video, phone number, document, 
promo code, coupon, map, email, opt-in form, etc., etc. And these QR barcodes are not just limited to for sale signs. They can just as easily be used in other forms of print and electronic advertising. Once you get started using QR codes, you won't believe how many different ways that you can use them. Mobile real estate professionals are constantly on the road. Whether on the way to a real estate appraisal, home inspection, or open house, it's important to drive safely. So here are some apps for you. Realtor dot com realtor dot com has more than four million home listings which include multiple photos property details open house information and pricing and updates them every fifteen minutes users are able to search for homes by location revisit saved searches privately rate listings and note and share listings with others. Home buyers have many tools to use in their search for property and one is Zillow.com, an online site designed for those who want to know about a specific property and the area where it's located. Zillow.com is a free service and users can look up the property value of any address. But reviews of Zillow.com are mixed overall, with some people liking Zillow.com for its ability to indicate property value and others not liking Zillow.com for its numerous mathematical errors and its lack of detail. Zillow.com is quick, easy, and free to look up a home value but also riddled with errors and very unreliable. Most believe that Zillow.com is good for showing relative neighborhood values at best. ACAR is an all-in-one handy application for your Android-supported device to effectively track the fuel mileage and cost maintenance business and non-business trips and mileages and general expenses of your vehicles. Whether you want to track the fuel mileage, expenses or maintenance of your vehicles or simply know if your vehicles operate at their maximum performance, ACAR can be the right tool for you. Along with its user-friendly user interface, ACAR will provide you with tons of detailed statistics, information, and graphical charts and reports to inform you how your vehicles are performing at any given moment. You'll never miss a maintenance service because it's changed and it's included with the program. Changing air filter, engine oil, or inspections. Using this particular program can make maintenance of your car quite a thing of the past. DriveSafe.ly is a mobile application that reads text or SMS messages and emails aloud in real time and automatically responds without drivers touching the mobile phone. DriveSafe.ly is the solution to texting while driving. DriveSafe.ly is available on BlackBerry smartphones and Android phones for free. iPhones and Windows mobile phones will be supported in the near future. RepairPal can't tell you what is wrong with your car, but if you tell it which repair sh the shop says you need, plus what car you have and where you live, it will tell you the real price range for the repair. The data that goes into the generation of this range is gathered from a number of sources, including one of the super secret labor cost estimator tables that's been available exclusively to mechanics. That is, up until now. RepairPal has a five-year exclusivity on this data. 
Mortgage Calculator Pro makes it easy to calculate monthly payments for fixed rate loans. You can add different adjustments such as insurance, property tax, loan length, months and years, and interest and down payment and monthly fees such as HOA fees to see how they would affect the monthly payment. A complete payment schedule allows you to view the interest, principal, and remaining balance for each and every payment of the loan. The app also allows you to save and organize all of your various loans so you do not have to repeatedly enter the information when viewing the options. Recalc. You can use Recalc to calculate the monthly payment, term, interest rate, or loan amount for a loan, as well as the standard mathematical calculations as you would in any other calculator. You can modify any of the calculation variables and recalculate any of the values. You can also figure in annual property tax homeowners insurance and mortgage insurance as well as a down payment and an amount or percentage. Recalc supports semi-annual compounding for Canadian users in addition to normal monthly compounding. With a click you can display the complete loan summary and amortization table for your calculation. You can also email this to your desktop or your prospects. Google Earth, of course, which helps users get a feel for a neighborhood, quality of nearby homes, location in relationship to busy streets, etc. Once they've found an interesting home listing online as it provides 360 degree panoramic street level views, it also offers a high quality bird's eye view of a home, which can answer certain questions a potential buyer may have about a house's structure before climbing on its roof or other relative inaccessible locations. Yelp is a great to do when you are out looking at houses. It allows you to locate and read reviews about nearby locations, say coffee shops, restaurants, gas stations, shops and more and learn more about a neighborhood's offerings. You can even narrow your search to identify which locations are currently open if you want to relax and grab a bite to eat in between house tours. GIST is another great app. Pull together all your contacts from your address books, inboxes, and social networks to access all in one place. This app also pulls in your contacts, status updates from their social networking pages, blog posts, and news to create an up-to-date business profile for all your contacts. iPhone and Android are the phones to use for this particular app. Well, let's take a look now at wireless point of sale. Text messaging is the new advertising medium. Now that we've talked about various smartphone apps and how to buy online using your smartphone, let's now take a look at advertising and marketing using your smartphone. Now let's talk about smartphones with point of sale. There's a huge number of gateways, processors, and mobile networks rolling out to service the number of users wanting to use point of sale. To name just a few merchants, there are the following. There are plenty of mobile merchants, 1.3 million service professionals, 320 amusement parks, 570 ski areas, 16,000 golf courses, 15,000 specialty retailers, 44,000 temporary retailers, and 75,000 taxis. And this has not even been updated. Plus, enterprise fleets and growing sellers are entering this field as well. Mobile integration. Because everything can now be integrated with your smartphone, 
more and more people are getting into combining all of their different mediums into one access standard. And the one communication standard, interestingly enough, that has really taken off is texting. Here are a few statistics of interest. There are 2.5 times as many users of texting than email worldwide. 37% or 1.3 billion email users versus 92% or 3.2 billion text users. 6% of Americans have a Twitter account. 33% of all Americans have a Facebook account. And more than half of all working males don't check their Facebook daily. 37% of Americans actively use email. And look at this, 92% of Americans have a cell phone and 98% of users have SMS enabled handsets. Now, let's take a look at some other percentages and statistics. 276 million mobile phones in the U.S., or 92% of the population. We send 4.1 billion texts per day, or two times the number from last year. 39.2 is the average age of a frequent text user. Three times the number of Americans send three times more text messages than phone calls per month. 98% of cell phones are text-enabled, as we mentioned, and 67% of all mobile users would like to receive reminders or alerts. And that is as of January 2nd of last year, 2010. Now let's focus on a little bit more to what affects us with current advertising trends and what is coming down the pike. Here's a look at some selected categories of ad spending in 2009 versus 2008. This is the closest that I had to be able to pull from. Note that the largest decline was in regional cable TV, down 25%. Next was newspapers, down 23%. Then broadcast TV, down 20%. Radio was down 19% and magazines were down 18%. But look at three interesting trends. Satellite radio up 3%. Online search engine advertising up 7%. And mobile ads has shot up 9% in just one year. And note that the interesting thing is that those who are texting the most now are not the teenagers but the 45 plus age group being the fastest growing demographic. To learn why texting has become so popular, let's take a text messaging 101 class. We're going to learn how to text call to action. There are two parts to a basic text message. At its most basic, there is the keyword, which can change from message to message. And there is the short code, which stays the same as this is whom you are sending the message. So let's take an example of an old marketing plan put to a high-tech use. We're going to get a deal from Chuck's Steakhouse that for every person we send in with a special code, they'll agree to give a free dinner or of equal value, not including drinks or dessert. Basically, you're exchanging advertising for them for a meal at wholesale. It's a win-win situation for you. So here's how it works. Text food to 72727 to receive a free dinner of your choice at Chuck's Steakhouse with one purchased of equal value. Note, in our smartphone, we send the message to 72727, and the message is food. 
When the message has been received, a message is sent back with the special code for the free meal. This simple message can be put on any flyer, marketing piece, or even blast email. Now let's raise the bar again. Instead of simple prospect marketing, let's take a look at the world of CMS, or Customer Management Systems. In order to work or accumulate customer names and data and be able to work them, you'll need an opt-in agreement from them. That means you'll need to offer something of value. Now here's three ways to get an opt-in from your viewers. Get the client to text keyword to short code, in this case 72728. How do you get the client to text you? Easy. Offer them something of value that they can't get somewhere else easily. Give them the opportunity to subscribe to new listings over the phone. Point of sale engagements. The reason why subscribe to new listings is such a great point of sale is that it's almost a guaranteed way for the buyer to want to give you their name and email address and thus want to opt into your database. Combine with traditional methods. Of course, you'll have this feature on your website, blog site, and even social media. You can even use this with even more traditional methods. And use in social networks. If you have a good social media network going with a number of people following you, this can also be a great place to advertise your subscription for new listings. Opt in. Add the mobile opt-in option to your current website. Deliver your coupons via text. By delivering your opt-ins via text, you're making it easier and more fun for your viewer to get this information and thus you're getting their opt-in approval. The environmental friendly way to deliver and of course those concerned with environmental friendly concerns will understand the value of delivering your message electronically. Coupons, no wasting ink or paper. With no paper coupons, not only are we environmentally friendly, but we are not wasting ink, paper, or money. And number three, the written disclaimer. Your clients sign a disclaimer currently? Add the mobile opt-in verbiage and upload every client into your mobile database. There are a variety of ways and reasons that your customers will want to engage with you. Here are just a few that you can create with your smartphone. Remember that each of these 8 to 12 character codes are the messages the customer will type in after typing in the to field in our case, 72727. You might ask them to type in text for VIP in order to get VIP only discounts, offers, specials, and invitations. Or how about text for discount in order to get a coupon for, let's say, 10% off. You could also text for coupon to get a coupon for a free soft drink. How about text to win to get a chance to win one of let's say three great prizes. You could also do text for info to get your phone address and website. And another one could be text for updates in order to get VIP updates of upcoming bands and entertainment. I could go on and on, but I think you get the picture. This is simply a new twist on an old, very effective prospecting device. Do they have to be each of these texting messages, text for VIP and so forth? No! Make up your own. Decide on what makes sense for you. 
Why is mobile marketing so important and so fruitful? Here's a study done by Avid Mobile showing the percentage of clients who read your marketing messages in different mediums. Now when asked to reply to this questionnaire, the respondents could choose multiple choices. So here's what they chose. Mobile marketing, 97%. In other words, almost everyone reads your mobile marketing messages. Print ads, 0.25%. Almost nobody reads print ads anymore. Direct mail, <laughs> this is a whopping 1.5%. And email, coupons were read by at least 5%. Now for the important part of our text marketing discussion. How do you know it's working? Well, we can start with a 97% read rate. So just putting your message out there, almost everyone is reading it. That's an important point. The next thing that we're going to know is from the major industries and corporations from these studies is that this redemption rate of your offerings runs between 9 to 22% or sometimes higher. An example of a redemption rate might be if General Mills is offering a free toy for a mailing in a cereal box top, the percentage of those that send it in out of those that buy the cereal, well, that's the redemption rate. But we also have to count something else in our text messaging strategy, and that would be the forwarding rate. This would be the rate at which this offering gets forwarded to others. A 5 to 32 percent rate is fairly wide, but what it means is that it's magnifying your marketing efforts and being increased for you. A recent study put out by the IHL group, an interesting analysis of consumer trends is revealed. Looking at a variety of retail-related consumer mobile activities. Text coupons led both in terms of current engagement, 25%, and planned engagement in the next 12 months, 47%. This study shows that text coupons is not only the wave of the future, but is also here now. So let's take a look at the most important points we've talked about so far. You must have a mobile enabled website. If your customer goes to your website and it's not mobile enabled, they'll be totally frustrated in scrolling around trying to find features. Your mobile enabled website must offer subscribe to new listings. It goes without saying that this is the most important feature on your website. So you should offer it from your smartphone as well. Your smartphone must have QR barcode technology. QR barcode technology is going to be the wave of the future. You just watch how many for sale signs start showing up with these barcodes to give the prospect an easier way to get information that you want them to have. And text messaging is the new marketing method of choice. Just when you thought that there wasn't anything new in prospecting, along comes text message advertising, a fun and productive way to use an old prospecting method of offering coupons and discounts for information. You must have a convergence of all these tools that synchronize your smartphone and your website. Most of all, now you must have all these tools synchronized together. We here at Strategic Storm are proud to be on the cutting edge of this technology by creating a website, blog site, social media bundle rolled into one power site.
Internet marketing has been left to the elite. Top agents understand the two facets of Internet marketing. First, they have optimized websites, making them visible to their prospects on Google. Second, they have compelling websites that make the prospect want to stay and give their information. The vast majority of these agents use the gold SEO plan. It puts their website at the top of Google. And just some of the features in the gold SEO plan are blog site creation and optimization, social bookmarking site submissions, competitor research analysis, link building, plus 15 more optimization features. For years, this has been our most popular SEO plan at $35.95, but it's yours for a limited time if you mention this video for only $19.95. But that's not all. Here's another idea. Allow me to introduce the Power Site, the feature perfect website, the first website to put the power of a 10 year study finding the 20 most compelling website features to get you leads leading to sales. The Power Site is the most feature rich, compelling website on the market today. Some of the features in the Power Site include the gold SEO plan. That alone is a $3,600 value. A professional rotating feature property slideshow. Subscribe to new listings or the new listing alerts. Video trailer inserts plus 16 more compelling features. And because it includes the gold SEO plan, it's our best value. And all of this for only $19.95. Call us today and ask to see available live sites and testimonials. For more information and to order, call 800-277-1316. Use your smartphone to click on the QR barcode shown or order online at ourpowersites.com. Use your credit card to secure these special offers. Don't delay. Call 800-277-1316. 1316 now. Plus, if you call today, not only can you get these special prices, but you can also get our bundled pricing for both products for only $29.95. This limited time offer will only be available for those who mentioned this video offer. Remember the words of Theodore Roosevelt. In any moment of decision, the best thing that you can do is the right thing. The next best thing is the wrong thing. And the worst thing that you can do is nothing. Well, the decision is yours to make. We hope to hear from you and have a great day.